गवर्नमेंट हैज़ डिक्लेयर्ड राखी गढ़ी एज आइकॉनिक हड़प्पन साइट राखी गढ़ी इज लार्जेस्ट आर्कियोलॉजिकल साइट ऑफ द हड़प्पन कल्चर सिचुएटेड इन टू मॉडर्न विलेज नेम्ड एज राखी शाहपुर एंड राखी खास इन हिसार डिस्ट्रिक्ट ऑफ हरियाणा दिस हैज़ बीन कैटेगराइज एज वन ऑफ द मेजर मेट्रोपोलिटन सेंटर ऑफ हड़प्पन कल्चर दिस साइट वॉज फर्स्ट एक्सकवेटेड बाय द आर्कोलॉजिकल सर्वे ऑफ इंडिया इन नाइनटीन नाइन्टी एट टू टू थाउजेंड वन लेटर डेकन कॉलेज पुणे एक्सकवेटेड द साइट फ्राम टू थाउजेंड थर्टीन टू टू थाउजेंड सिक्सटीन द प्रजेंट एक्सकवेशन ऑफ राखी गढ़ी इज अंडरटेकन बाय द आर्कोलॉजिकल सर्वे ऑफ इंडिया अंडर डायरेक्टरशिप ऑफ डॉक्टर संजय कुमार मंजुल हु इज ज्वाइन डायरेक्टर जनरल ऑफ द आर्कोलॉजिकल सर्वे ऑफ इंडिया द एक्सकवेशन स्टार्टेड ऑन ट्वेंटी फोर्थ फेब्रवरी दिस ईयर विद द एम ऑफ डेवलपिंग द साइट एज वन ऑफ द आइकॉनिक साइट विच वॉज डिक्लेयर बाय द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया द आइडिया इज टू मेक द आर्कोलॉजिकल साइट ऑफ राखी गढ़ी एक्सेसिबल टू पीपल बाय एक्सपोजिंग द स्ट्रक्चरल रिमेन्स एंड कंजर्विंग दैम फॉर फ्यूचर व्यूइंग अलॉन्ग विद प्रोवाइडिंग एम्यूनिटीज टू द विजिटर्स Dr Sanjay Manjul informed that the objective is also to understand the settlement of Rakhi Gadi and to identify the individuality and interrelationship of the seven mounds at the site one of the most important mounds at the site is mound number 7 which has yielded around 60 burials in the previous excavations in this field season two more burials have been excavated at this site these burials are of two female individuals who are buried with plethora of pottery and adorned jewelry like jasper and agate beads and shell bangles the archaeological survey of india officials informed that the present excavation will get over by the end of this month and the new field season will commence from september this year and memorandum of understanding is in process between archaeological survey of india and the government of haryana as per which antiquities from rakhi gadi will be displayed in museum which is under government of haryana actually if you see the rakhi gadi is very very important site of uh, harappan civilization it's of one of the uh, largest uh, settlement of uh, harappan habitation site uh, that has been named uh, particularly in uh, seven uh, different mounds uh, we are in the uh, mound number 1 uh, here and we have started uh, excavation at three mound mound number 1 mount number 7 and mount number 3 mount number 3 has not been at, uh, taken uh, 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 excavation particularly uh, in the past uh, by any of the agency the site is too vast it's no it's a spread uh, uh, more than the uh, 3500 hectare uh, of the land so uh, this site needs a serious approach of understanding of town planning serious approach of understanding of uh, the cultural component of uh, the the uh, the culture having a large span of time period around uh, uh, 7000 years so that large span for understanding of large span span of the every strata is uh, a very very uh, meticulous or meticulous task for understanding so that has been uh, you can understand uh, particularly the harappan uh, component the mature harappan comp- component as well as uh, the early harappan co- content so if you start from the early harappan the beginning of uh, the settlement uh, in this area uh, from uh, uh, starting from the ns uh, means natural soil so that has the deposit of 18 meter at mound number 4 and the different mound having the different deposition that shows the cultural continuity of that okay and apart from that if you th- uh, uh, see the mound number 1 we have uh, one street running east west and also cutting uh, north south so that span is around 18 meter and then by lane is there 
ओके एंड दैट हैज़ अ ह्यूज मड स्ट्रक्चर समटाइम हैविंग ब्रिक बर्न ब्रिक स्ट्रक्चर एट माउंट नंबर थ्री द सिमिलर काइंड ऑफ प्लानिंग यू कैन सी इन द बोथ ऑफ द माउंट हैविंग द ड्रेनेज सिस्टम ऑल्सो द सोक पीट्स एंड जस्ट बिसाइड दैट यू कैन सी द हाउस प्लानिंग ऑफ दैट द हाउस प्लानिंग हैविंग द मल्टीपल रूम्स along with uh, the hearth and the pottries and uh, so on as you see the material culture like uh, the uh, beads of semi precious stone steatite bead the terracotta bead copper bead the uh, antimony rod of copper the copper point bone points chert blades a uh, terracotta figurine wheel of uh, uh, terracotta wheel of toy so these kind of things indicate that they have uh, the multifarious activity at the site that also also shows uh, the complex system of the society so that understanding of society through the uh, the uh, material cultural evidence as well as the town planning uh, uh, that very very important so that is the one of the motif for understanding of the town planning and the relation between each of the mound uh, uh, why they they has the separate mound in between two mound there is any uh, uh, bigger street or something else